Hello one and all, my name is Ryan Bruce, my friends call me Fluff, and today on Rifts, Beards, and Gear, we're going to check out the all-new Will Putney 2010 Tone Hub Pack from STL Tones. So we know STL Tones on this channel, we know STL Tones Tone Hub, and more importantly, we know the almighty Will Putney, kind of a buddy of mine, kind of a buddy. And he has just come out with a, a new preset pack that documents and captures his 20 favorite amps along with his 10 favorite cabinets, okay? Hence 2010, not the year 2010, 20X10 pack. What punny, turn up. Now the amps in this pack include, but are not limited to, the Diesel Herbert, the PRS Archon, the MLC Sub-Zero V, the Omega Granofire, the PV5152, the Drifford Purple Nightmare, Bogner, Ubershaw, and I'm starting to slur all the names. There's a lot of amps. There's a lot of amps to get through, and there are over 350 individual presets. We are not going to get to all of them in this video, spoiler alert, sorry, but I will grab my guitar, we will check some of these out, we will play around with the presets. However, first, let's hear this in the context of a mix. All right, so I have STL Tone Hub up. I have the Will Putney 2010 pack up. And let's go to the amp uh, view. So of course, like all Tone Hubs, we have stomp, amp, cabinet, equalizer, and effects. I'm gonna start with the amplifier block. Now, something to note is in each amp cluster, each, each cabinet is in the same order. So the Atlas Cabs 612 Celestion Vintage 30 cabinet will always be the first in an, a given amp cluster, if that makes sense. So that makes it kind of easy for me to go to the, oh, okay, here's the PRS amp cluster. I know this first one is gonna be the Atlas cabs. And I know this MLC Sub-Zero is gonna, the first one's gonna be the Atlas cabs and so on and so forth, okay? So let's start with the very first preset. I haven't done anything to it. Let's just see how this sounds. <laughs> Now, I am coming in super hot, and my input was goosed a little bit from a different guitar I was playing earlier. However, if we want to fine-tune the input on Tone Hub, we can do that. So I have a Music Man with my active Fishman signature pickup in the bridge, and we can tell it that I have a high output pickup. And now STL Tones has set my volume for me. Pretty nice of them. Now, let's go PRS Archon, same cabinet, Atlas Cabs, my favorite. So good, but if I wanna fine tune that, I can come over to the cab block, of course. I can play with the microphone angle. I can drag this over a little bit. All right, I wanna check out the MLC Sub-Zero. I 
do have the overdrive on. I forgot to mention that, but I like it on. I like the overdrive. The overdrive, the actual drive is on zero. You know, it's, I'm just boosting the level. I'm boosting it as a standard boost as anyone would. However, let's check out a couple of different cabinets. Bogner Uber Cab. <laughs> I'm gonna leave the overdrive on and ooh, Omega Grano Fire. Again, I'm gonna start with the Atlas. <laughs> Now notice this preset has the Overdrive 2 on. Now, if I want to fine tune that, I'm going to come over to my equalizer block. I'm going to turn on the block and then I can do whatever I want. I'm going to select my frequency. Uh, for example, if I wanted to dip a little bit of that honkiness, you can just. Now, when I think of Will, I think of the PV5152, right? And I'm a huge N fan. I'm a huge fan of all of his guitar tones that he's worked on with all sorts of bands and all sorts of albums. I'm gonna start with the 5152. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds awesome okay let's play with the microphone a little bit why not because we can right angle angle <laughs> The PV is probably my favorite tone. I know I'm skipping around here a bunch, but oh man, these, these sound awesome. Let's do Driftwood Purple Nightmare. Channel two. Let's do it with the uh, Boogie Oversized. Super it will you like a lot of gain, my guy? Woo. It's just gross. And you know, I don't even need to touch that. What stomp is he using? Overdrive one. Yeah. So good. Bogner Uber Shawl. Let's check out the Bogner Uber Shawl. I'm gonna start with the Atlas and then probably go to one of the boogie oversized or the Zilla Fat Boy. Hear all those overtones? I love it. We're having fun, we're having fun. So good. Now we're going to get down. Oh yeah. I got, I said, I got to, uh, we're going to try the Zilla. That's what we're going to do.
That's a different flavor. That's cool. Okay, let's go for something a little, little less gainy. On the notes, we can actually sort. Let's see, low gain, Uber shawl. Ooh, driftwood. Let's do the driftwood. I'm gonna sort by the presets. Actually, I clicked on the uh, the notes thing, and I'm gonna I'm gonna undo that. Ooh, Freeman JJ, one of my absolute favorite amplifiers of all time. Um, let's see. Let's do and let's play some effects. <laughs> And let's go to the effects block. I'm going to turn the block on, and then we're going to enable. You know what? I'm just going to turn these things on and see how it sound. I don't even care. <laughs> So nice. Thanks, Will. What a sweet, sweet sound. Okay. One more high gain. One more. Okay. Just one more. Let's find the Freeman J. There we go. Freeman JJ. All right. Atlas Cabs. Don't let me down. Let's do this. Here's what's great about the Freeman JJ, and this captures it very, very well. I use the amp, I mean, the amp is right there. Um, the Freeman JJ is crunchy, but in a really nice musical way, and that's captured here. Now, if you wanna clean that up a little bit, and you don't want all that, all that crunchiness on the top end, you're just gonna engage in overdrive. That's all you gotta do. And it's just lovely. Need volume. <laughs> This is a great tone for, you know, hard rock or rock or lead thing. Uh, this is where I have the settings on my amp 90% of the time when I'm reamping for a record or something like that. Super, super awesome. And that does it for the STL Tone Hub Will Putney 2010 preset pack. There's over 300 presets. I can't get to them all. However, the takeaway from this is the tones the tones are delicious. They're gooey, they're crunchy, they're just, you can snack on them. And they're from Will Putney. Will Putney sent you a snack and it's up to you to pick up the snack and nibble on it, okay? I don't know if that makes any sense, but it makes sense to me. And you know what? It sounds good, it sounds real good. I will link down below in the description for more information on the Will Putney Tone Pack. And with that, you've been wonderful, I've been Fluff. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time.